Well, so we're behind another, another tree here with a different variety. And, and the next group is? The next group is what I call Indian Alfonso. So uh, we have two categories of Indian flavored mangoes. The first was Indian West Indian, but the second is what I call Indian Alfonso. And what separates this group from the, the other Indian uh, flavored group is that in this group, the resin is not as pronounced and not as dominant in terms of its uh, its primary flavor profile. There's resin that occurs inside of the flavor of these mangoes, but the more important aspect of them is their spice component. So we're talking about cardamom, cinnamon, nutmeg, those kind of spices. I'm not talking about hot pepper spice. <laughs> okay, so when, when we describe a mango as spicy, it's not like uh, Thai restaurant spicy, okay? I mean, like, there is certain elements yeah. that you'll, you'll pick up, but, like, um, we're talking about the spices that go into, like, a pie, like hunger pie or something like that. So, um, in these mangoes, that, those spices are the more dominant trait of the flavor. So examples of this group, uh, besides the Angie mango behind me are the Alfonso mango itself, of course, from India. It's, uh, in certain parts of India, it's like regarded as the best mango to them. Um, Kesar mango from India falls into the same group. But also we have here in Florida, a number of Florida varieties that are in this group as well. So one of those would be the, uh, the Cary. Okay, which is an old Florida variety. Uh, we're also, uh, we would include things like Juliet, Super Julie, um, would be Indian Alfonso class mangoes. And, uh, there's mangoes from other countries as well, like the Itamaraca mango from uh, off the coast of Brazil has an Indian Alfonso type flavor. Um, do you have that one? Yeah, we, we have a couple of those here. They're, it's a dwarf tree that makes tiny little mangoes. Uh, and they're actually fiberless. They're not stringy. Um, but, uh, so those are a couple examples of the Indian Alfonso group. Uh, the next group I'll describe is Indian West Indian. The 